Good evening, everyone. This is Brewmaster. Danny here. Um, I a couple of reviews ago, um, I told you that Danny had ordered some beers directly from Belgium. Um, the last one was Golden Drac. This one is Rodenbach Grand Cru from the Palm Brewery. Um, it is the style is a sour red. It is brewed in Rosalier, Belgium. Um, it is a combination of one-third young beer and two-thirds uh, beer aged two years in oak casks. Um, it says the more important portion of this is oak matured beer and it contributes to its fruity taste, complexity, and intensity. Um, it gets a 95 on uh, or wait, it gets a 99 on, which one is this? Rate beer. Rate beer, okay. Yeah. It gets a 99 overall on rate beer and a 93 for style. And on uh, Beer Advocate, it gets a 95%, so very, very highly rated. Yeah. Um, it's a really pretty bottle. Go ahead and get a pour on this one, see what it looks oh, like. Yeah. When you pop it, you should hold it up close so we can see the smoke if there is some. Yeah, right. Because you can't see it unless it's really yeah. close. A just bit. a little, just a little spray. A little. <laughs> yeah, I've been, I've been excited to try this one. Haven't tried many sours, but the only ones I have tried have been awesome. Oh, that's so cool color. Oh, the color's awesome. Mmm, I smell it from here too. Yeah. <laughs> it looks fruity colored, you know. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's so fruity. Oh, yeah. Look at that beautiful... A deep oh, it's garnet. A, yeah, it really is. It's a ruby. Yeah. Oh, man. That's beautiful. Um, not a huge head. No. Yeah. A little half finger. Yeah. Um, just slightly off-white. Yeah. Get a nose and see what this one smells right. like. Oh. Oh, wow. Very, yeah. very tart right off. Tart, just, mm. oaky... Oh god, the cherries. cherries just yeah, so man. tart black cherries. Oh over. yeah. It just blasts tart cherries. Yeah, it's just, it's uh, so cherry, so oak, so mmm. Mm. Oh. So okay. much bread. Yeah. I mean it's a it's a slight vinegar smell to mm -hmm. it. Has to be, I mean they have to use Britannomyces. It's mm. such a mm. And I'm I'm also I'm coming to love bread. And it smells like um a lot of really tart wines. Yeah. Like a sherry vinegar. Oh, that is yeah, it's more, so uh, such a deep garnet to you. Yeah. I hold on, I will return in just a moment. I want to let you see the color of this. Mm. Sorry about that. I just really wanted you guys to get a glimpse of that color. I don't know if that'll be very good, but it's such a cool color. Yeah, it's it's very pretty. Very, very pretty. Well, let's get a taste of this one. Cheers. Cheers. Ooh, that is sour. That is tart. 
you got those cherries, that oak, that vinegar. Mmm. Yeah, that is delicious. Oh, wow. Mmm, it's so tart. Oh, this is so good. I, yeah, I, I really love sours. Yeah. And just like he said, you got like that tart cherry right off, a little bit of that dry oak sort of a bitterness, mm. uh, that, that little bit of a, a vinegary. It's so very, it's so very smooth too. That light carbonation to it, it lends to that smooth mouthfeel. And There's, it's a very light, it's a lighter mouthfeel, you know. It's. I tell, I will say one thing. There's definitely not any hot presence in this one. Mm -mm. I got no nothing, no earthy, no citrusy kind of hop, nothing. Oh. Like it's just whatever they put it was just enough to. Mm, this is so good. Aged in oak vats. Um, I believe this brewery has been around since 1821. Very cool bottle. I, I want a whole entire barrel of this. Okay, when <laughs> is this? It's oh yeah, this is six percent ABV. Sorry, I didn't say that yet. When did where did you say you saw this was good until? Oh, the date right there. Here. Yeah, nine twenty-two of sixteen. Oh yeah, nine twenty-two of sixteen. So a few years. <laughs> Yeah. It's got, and it would probably be good even a little longer if you kept it in the right conditions. I mean, some of these beers are a year old when they're bottled. Mm. That is very, very tasty. So tart. Yes. Mm. Some people may not be a fan of tart beers, of uh, sours, of farmhouse ales. I am very much a fan of them. Mm. Um, if you like anything to do with... Uh, Brettanomyces. I hope I'm saying that right. I think I am. But Brett Yeast, uh, then pick some of this up. Yeah. This it's, is there's beautiful. There's a reason it is so highly rated. It's beautiful. It is delicious and pretty much a work of art. Yeah, indeed. Um, I just got to hand it to Belgians. Belgian people. They, they know what they are doing with some ale. All the different styles. and They have, um, over the last year and a half or so doing these reviews they have definitely become my favorite type of type of ale for if yeah. it's from Belgium pretty much it's going to be delicious yeah um well as always guys you uh hit that like button if you like the video uh please subscribe and leave any comments in the box below thank you and cheers try this one cheers <laughs>